In the future, the scenario for circumvention could get a lot worse because right now a lot of countries do their own censorship. Now, if a lot of countries with a lot of resources dedicate uh, more resources and cooperate in censoring, then the, the sort of arms race that we have now will be accelerated. I guess an interesting broader question is whether there is something that would somehow break us out of the cycle where somehow people would just stop censoring the internet or somehow some tool would just work in all cases. At the moment, I don't imagine a way for that to happen. On the other hand, recent events have meant that more people are aware of internet censorship and are aware that circumvention tools, uh, especially ones that you can uh, donate bandwidth to, let you help people across the globe, and that's a very attractive option. Imagine an Iran that the dictators are not ruling anymore there. So definitely we will have more internet freedom. I, I won't say that will be a, there will be a totally free internet, but much more free than what it is now. There's a lot of talk about tools that solve everyone's problems, but there will never be a magic bullet. Even if there is a technologically perfect solution, there are social ways to get around things. Uh, no matter how private your communications are, if you tell somebody else about what you're doing, someone that you can't trust, uh, then no technology is going to save you. Um, I hope the future of circumvention is um, enabling more people to have access into, to the internet and to communicate what they need to do, um, what they need to say. But also, I hope there's another future which is, in order to get to that point, we need actually a lot of software development um, and awareness um, um, of what circumvention is and what the possibilities are. I think the internet itself is the magic bullet. So it's, it's actually changing the world even if you censor it. And this is what the repressive regimes know much more, much better than anyone else in the world. So you look at their reactions, what they do, and what, what are they feeling about. In the future, there won't be any magic bullet that solves all your circumvention needs, but there will be many tools uh, which work uh, for maybe just one small community, and so which are very difficult to block. We don't have the perfect solution and uh, it's not good to trust someone who says that they have the perfect solution. It just doesn't exist. I think the magic bullet for this whole area is um, for people to be nice to each other. <laughs> for, for governments and organisations to allow people to communicate freely with each other. I mean, that's the magic bullet, definitely.